We, we're, we literally have enough food in here for a while. Until we are secure to go out there. I'm gonna leave those bears asses out there as a trap. There are early guard dogs, and why not have freaking 17 grizzly bears? Hello everyone, Blaze Archer here. Welcome back to some more Star Wars Rim World Surviving on Tatooine. So in the last episode, or if you guys want to get caught up in the series up to this point, there'll be a pop-up in the top right of your screen. Go check it out. That way you guys are fully up to date what's been going on with the series. So in the last episode, I did uh, ask for a vote what you guys would like to see in the game as a new horror to fight against. And you guys voted on the Forsaken. All right, here we go. So we're going to add the faction in. I want you guys to see it on here as I am. Um... I know how strong these guys are. I know how ridiculously powerful these guys are. I'm going to keep it on five only. And probably a little further away. We'll eventually fight them, but I don't want it to be right now. We'll leave it at six. All right, here we go. But now that I know they're on their way, we got to make some preparations. Um, first of all, this has to be reinforced. Um... Not there. Uh, who are you? Um, I'm guessing you want to trade. So, Shando, go out and trade. Um, defenses are looking a little bland. We need a little bit more. And I think we need to possibly start... Yeah. Start putting something back here as well. Uh, just in case we have to fall back and run, but, uh, yeah, I think we need to expand out our defenses. Defenses are not good enough anymore, especially against the Forsaken. Not enough. How do we do that? You have no idea. Not a clue. Um. Okay. What we can do is start oops start fortifying this put this here put another bunker here let's put another bunker here where they'll be firing more inwards with machine gun fire so if they get too close we could shoot them there um it's just an idea i'm trying to think of all these possible ways we could fight them um Cancel that. Let's make this a little bit bigger. Uh, orders go to deconstruct. Then we'll put some guns in here too. Um, yeah, we just gotta do whatever it takes to slow these guys down because if I remember correctly, these suckers have shields. So we need to spray as many rounds as we possibly can on these guys. That was a little too fast. Uh, Koto gel. Cool. What else do you got? Definitely could use more of that. You know, just for the simple. Oh. Because I remember wealth of my colony is not based on just silver. It's based on what I have. So, oh boy. Okay. So. How do we do this? How do we do this? No idea. I think we're okay for right now. Anyways, back to what I was doing. Yes, we're going to reinforce that wall. We're going to reinforce this wall. And we're going to reinforce that wall. We're going to make sure they're not getting in. Because these suckers will try to dig through. If they can. I'm just trying to reinforce every wall. Okay. Um... Who is our constructor? Well, guess what? I need everybody on construction detail if you can do it. 
Alright. Uh, tell. Okay, you're still here. Um, what else? Oh, yeah. We're, we're getting close to that being done. I think I was originally planning on going down the droid. Get simple droids and get, you know, combat droids. But I think getting to bigger guns... I'll look at that in a minute. Getting to, like, light installation turrets and turbo laser towers, that is going to be the way to go. What is this? What is this? I don't like what this is. So, everybody grab a gun. Let's go. Yo, Dodo, it's not a time to be insulting people right now. What the... Oh, I hate that. I hope you blow up. Gonna use the, our machine guns. Fire at it, don't melee it. you doing? Oh, you're gonna tend to him. Tend to him. They running? Good. Cause they left a dog out here. It's being a pain in my ass. <laughs> Thank you. It's just one of those days. I just, just people. Come on. Okay. You. Go heal him. Okay, now he's better. Someone finish this damn thing off. Uh, let's see. What you, what's wrong? What, what, what do you guys have? Nope, sorry, finishing you guys off. Alright, I also need someone on repair duty because apparently these guys are jerks. Alright, Rooster, I need you repairing, deconstructing. I want her deconstructing and building. We gotta get these walls up. ASAP. Oh, what's this? Advanced repair kit. Yes, please. Okay, yes, please. Okay. 
Man, these guys just absolutely destroyed my stuff. Uh, yeah, the raid's gone. Okay. Uh, all right, put all that away. Okay. Come on, guys. How are we doing? Almost done. Fantastic. Rooster, please come over here. Get working. We gotta shore up our defenses right now, please. Because, yeah, if we, we, we definitely need more than just two of these. Lost a mortar, that does suck, but it's not the end of the world. But it definitely does not, it's not going good. Who is our researcher? Do we do nothing else? Yeah, Warhawk, that's all you need to be doing right now, is just absolutely crushing it. Um, wait, was that Warhawk? Yeah, we're hockey. You just gotta crush it, dude. Wait a minute. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. That is not what we need. That is not what we need. Out of steel? No way. Wake up. I need you to wake up right now. Hey, worst comes to worst, if we get overrun, we are hopping on that ship and getting that out of here. And we'll make we'll run to another planet and we'll try to survive on another planet. We're just here hiding out. There's nothing says we cannot leave on our ship. right now we're gonna be out of power please and thank you okay no longer running out of power Phew, thank god after you're doing whatever you're doing come build these guns please okay not in home area that's why they're not oh wow Now it's in the home area. You will go fix it. Hmm. 
Build these. Alright, four of the four E webs should really do the trick, I hope. And what we'll do is we will keep the door open so they will come in. And since it's really scattered all over the place, what we'll do is wait till they get right about here and then we'll just get on the guns and unload. That way we're more accurate. Even though we're gonna be probably wearing brown pants because how close these guys will get. Yeah, I, I think the smarter move. Where's Warhawk? Warhawk, you shouldn't even be... Whatever you're doing, you shouldn't be doing it. Yeah, no no kidding. Dude, you, you should eat. Go research. That's it. Eat, research. That's it. Nothing else. And I think what we're going to do... Quest complete. Cool. Awesome. What we're going to do is come up here, and I'm going to add a bill. So we're not getting those, so forget that. Uh, we're going to come down here. These right here. I want to make pick four of them. That way we can get more of those, because if those are the only things that are hit, punching and killing mechanoids at long range, we need everybody with one of those to fight against those guys for when they come. So that is a priority. And in fact, what we're going to do is get these guns to people right now. Uh, Rooster, yeah, if, you, if I sound paranoid, it's because I am. What do you need? High density drone. Hungry. Oh my god. Jin, what's wrong with your kid? So Rooster, you're getting that gun. Who else does... I think it's Tego that doesn't have a gun? No, Tego has a gun. Warhawk is the other one. Okay. So I'm going to come over here to mend. Just remember, apparel... Oops, no. Apparel. I'm going to go to mass. Make sure they don't work on this. I don't care about those. Um, over here to bills. Want this to be added in, and it do until. You have 40 of them. And then we can start fixing up our gear. But I won't do masks. I mean, those things are cheap. There's no point. Reinstall there. Reinstall there. Um, I think I need to tell everybody when you wake up. We all need some tea. Everybody needs to just wake up, have a nice cup of coffee. How good is the shuttle? And the shuttle's fine? How did you guys get in here? So it's for a few days. That sucks. <laughs> that really sucks. Move that over just a little bit. I don't want to be firing into a wall. That would really not be a cool thing. You see? <laughs> Rooster's like, I'll, I'll just follow her around.
Um. Warhawk, your girlfriend is tearing up the room. What did you do? Hey, Warhawk. Good boy. Good boy. Good man. We'll give you some privacy. Make her happy. Okay, now we need to move this school down here. Um, yeah, we're preparing for the worst case scenario, but we also want to prepare in case we can live here for a while. A while. You know what I'm going to do? Oh, this is going to be a good idea. At least for a while. Everybody indoors. We, we're, we literally have enough food in here for a while until we are secure to go out there. I'm gonna leave those bears asses out there as a trap. There are early guard dogs, and why not have freaking 17 grizzly bears? That will maybe slow those things down for a few minutes. I'm okay with that. Absolutely okay with that. <laughs> Oh my god, am I okay with that? <laughs> I'm okay with that. Oh boy. Yeah, we'll just not look over there for right now because of the sound. But that will also give us a chance. No, I did not want that. I, I just wanted to move, not build a copy, which I probably did that by accident. No, I did it again. Okay, there we go. Reinstall. There we go. I can't believe I put that in backwards. <laughs> I'm a little stressed. Just just a little bit, guys. I'm paranoid, and I know that at some point very soon we're going to get attacked probably by those guys, and I don't think we're ready. I really don't. But we are building more weapons to be ready for it. Okay. That's coming in here. Let's put some lights in here now, shall we? Yeah, I know. Hang on a second, guys. Uh, that one. That one. And, oops, that one as well. Cancel. Haul out of here. Come on. They can stay out there all they want. I don't care. I really don't. How are we doing on steel? Eh. Kinda. Sorta. Not really. Who's our tailor? Tago. But he's the one doing manufacturing. Tell me we're close to being able to do this. Oy, 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 oy. 
Yeah, range uh, melee weapons are absolutely useless now. Go frenzy. Wonderful. Power's looking good. Uh, Warhawk, what are you doing? Sleeping. Okay, that's your only excuse. Is sleeping. Yeah, I'm not ashamed to admit it. I'm gonna use these bears. Am I paranoid for putting up an extra wall? Yep. I want them to have no other choice but to come down here. I just realized something. We are also extremely vulnerable up here as well. Yep, we paranoid. School is coming along. I also want to put down a comm station. Right there in the school. Uh, he's almost, what is he working on? Okay, it is that, yeah. Okay. It is done. Light installation, go. Don't stop. Don't stop. Believe. No, we're not doing that one. What other cool stuff did we just get our hands on? Not a lot. Add Bill. And there's nothing still. Hypertech Fabricator. There we go. Now we're looking good. And this will allow us to make clothing. Um, it will allow us to make more of these, which are expensive. Um, which is, I believe, it's steel and an advanced component, so they're very expensive. We need to start trimming their numbers down. <laughs> the bears are sleeping. Okay, good. All right, with this wall, we will be somewhat more secure. I pretty much want them, no matter what, they have to come through this way. One, the bears. And two, well, then they're, they have to fight us. I got scared there for a second. I am literally on edge waiting for the alert, which I now would probably just jinx myself, but I'm waiting for that alert to come through. That, hey, we're under attack by the Forsaken. Rare Thrombo. Oh, that would be nice. Oh, we have a lot of food. Visitors? I don't know if that's a good time for you to come here. Oh, those poor Jawas. Guy, I'm, I'm, nope, nope, nope. Yeah, smart. Don't come down here. Oh, they're leaving? 
Okay, now I'm officially sad because now we gotta go get them for food. Go. And they're leaving. Cool. <gasps> no! No! No, 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 no. Who brought the baby? I don't even have words. I really don't. That's just ter disturbing. <sighs> okay. Now that the door is... Ooh, sorry, Warhawk. Now that the door is open, the bears are gone. We now have to get out there and start building our defenses. All right, cool. And plenty of food. It's not like we're running out of food anytime soon, thankfully. Too bad those guys, I don't think even the Forsaken are immune to the cold. Like, I think they, no, I think they are mean to the cold. I don't know what their weakness is, other than a lot of blaster fire and a lot of weapons down range to stop them. That's probably it. We all could use a party right now. Only we can get the music going. Okay. All right. All right, cool. Let's see what you guys got. What was that? What is that? It says it's a mercenary and she's 55, 52. She's very tiny. Who is our best negotiator? Bio, that it's under socials. Apparently a busy. Okay. Are you done doing what you're doing? Yes. All right. So head out there, please. Oh 
we got here? Uh, I would absolutely like to take all your components off of you. about all I want to get off of you guys right now. Advanced components. Not so much. And we're still making a profit. Darn, I'm good. Um, what is this? Venom Fangs? Learning Assistant? Uh, is there anything else? What is this? Oh, okay. Uh, do 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 do. I don't see anything else that I want. We could probably sell some of our animals. Keep this one, keep those, sell these. No, I'm gonna keep them because that is an emergency rations. You pick up, haul those please. Someone else can come get that later. Okie dokie, so we got components and we made a profit. Call that a win. Oh. Finally. Welcome. Man, a colonist. Uh. Okay. He can now. What can you do? Uh, we'll have you just on clean and haul. That's it. Or make deliveries. You're just going to be a nice little helper. Or that. You know, we'll have you do the simple job so the, the adults can do the rest. Uh, be a patient. Uh, no, you don't have to do haul urgently because it might be somewhere dangerous. All right, so hopefully he gets, oh, he got some clothes on. He's no longer in there anymore. Yeah, we need to make this room look better too. How are we doing on stone? Not enough that I'd feel comfortable making a room full of nice flooring. Um, get the milk inside. Okay. You don't have for weapons. Pop. F oh, okay. It's for firefighting. Well, see you guys later. Have a good time. doing a research we're hopefully getting there I'm hope I'm really hoping that Warhawk gets done what he needs to do
I'm gonna try to keep everybody on the same schedule. There, so they have to go to work, and then they'll probably keep working, get a little recreation. Try to keep everybody on the same schedule. reason these guys are not they're the hardest workers keeping us alive so they get a little extra rest yeah because they're the only ones actually those three rooster her yeah Jin. Enora and Rooster, they're the ones that are building everything, crafting everything, and just jack of all trades, so they get a little extra sleep. I know what I just thought about, just to help out. Let's go stockpile over here. Critical. We'll put steel in there. We'll hide it. We'll have steel here so that we can load the guns. Mad booming up. Where? They, really? Fires, go put out the fires quickly. Norton, you can't put out fires. That's like critical one oh one, buddy. That was a mistake. Sorry, Lucy. Right? Big toe destroyed. <laughs> Alright. Okay. Light. Well, medium installations is mineral miner. Get to that. I want this stuff. And what we can do, if we get enough tobacco gas, I did not mean to do that. If we are able to do enough, and depending on how big the turrets are and everything, we'll probably put a bunker here, here. Uh, have, you know, fight outwards, uh, and then, you know, over here as well. So that way, no matter which way they come from, they will die. There's going to be no way for them to not die. Okay, production. Actually, no. Let's go down here, type it in. Okay, give me a second here. Light installation. Fusion reactor. Where's that at? What would it be under? I 
Okay, this is kind of BS. Where is it? Could it be it's it we can't see it because there's too many things here? No, I did not mean to do that. Now I'm starting to get a little frustrated. We worked so hard to get to Tibetan gas. And we can't even make it. way to make like this bigger or uh, I have to be missing something where is it Because if we can't get to Bennett Gas, we're sunk. Where is it under? I wish I could, like, right click, say, yeah, I want to build this. Okay, apparently I gotta type in extractor. Fine. Whoop, did, okay. Okay. Where is Tabanic gas? Please tell me there's some on this map. It would really suck if there wasn't. I'm just gonna put it there and see what happens. that they give us we're learning this we're learning this on the fly uh so panic unrefined dependent gas must be placed outside of the coverage of any other Tibetan extractor. The hell does that mean? Okay. We'll let everything keep going. So we just type in that somehow works. There's the fusion reactor. Holy crap, does that take a lot? I have to look around for some Tibetan gas. 
what's it get? And what is it gonna even look like? No, that's a steam geyser. That's no. There is no Tibetan gas anywhere, is there? Oh man. No wonder it's so valuable. Like, the planets that have it absolutely make bank. Because apparently it's not an easy thing to find. This is not good. Yeah, that's, yeah. So it's not this type of geyser. It's the other one that has like the kind of the three holes. I think maybe. Well, that can go anywhere. Underground must be placed outside of the coverage of other. See, I don't get that. If anybody knows where exactly we need to put the Tabanic gas, let me know in the comment section down below because I don't have the faintest idea. Yeah, we could put it here. Like it was showing green. Meh, where is that at? Okay, we'll get to that in just a second. I could put it in the wall like that. It's green. Cool. Awesome. But is that actually where it needs to be you know what I mean like is that actually it um, yeah I, I don't think that's gonna work so something, I gotta figure out what to do with it because clearly that that's, yeah. Don't know. We're gonna quickly just get rid of this guy that's coming our way. Get him, Lucy. There you go, Lucy. But we are making preparations to fight against the Forsaken whenever they come our way. Because they will be coming our way eventually. But that is going to have to be the end of this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys did enjoy it. Um, a lot of things are going on. A lot of things did happen. But nonetheless, if you guys have any idea how to get the Tabanic gas, where it is. I'm also going to be looking at videos. So... But at the same time, don't just be discouraged. Please do let me know in case I can't find anything. Um, we, I will be looking where to find and extract tabanic gas. That's what I'm going to be doing between this episode and the next episode. Also, um, once this is done and we have the light ion cannons and light laser cannons, what I'm going to be doing next after that is droids. Because we just need droids to help out around. Because right now, my individual people, they're the ones doing most of the work. But we just need that extra hand. We need to get our droid back. We need to get him back online. And, yeah. All right. Cool. So, again, thank you guys so much for watching. Hopefully you guys enjoyed it as much as I did playing it. And if you guys have any comments, suggestions, or feedback about this episode. Or just about the series in general. Or just want to talk about Star Wars. Let me know in the comment section down below. Also, if you guys have not already, check out my Discord. Links for that will be in the description down below. Over there, you guys can talk with me, hang out with me, and other YouTubers, and other gamers. It is awesome and lots of fun. Hopefully, I see you guys over there. And last but not least, I would like to say thank you so much to my Patreon supporters. Thank you guys so much for going the extra mile to help support the channel. It really means a lot to me. Every dollar does not only help support the channel. <clears throat> Sorry. Does not only help support the channel, but also get your name at the end of the video as a thank you for helping support the channel. So until next time, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next episode. Take care, guys, and remember, 
Have an awesome day.